Reminds me. Yes, sir. Anthony, sir. Anthony. Yes, sir. So the specimen that I have right now, uh, that is the uh, right lung, sir. Yes, sir. So why, sir? So it, it is the right lung uh, because, as you can see, there are uh, three lobes and there are two fissures, sir. So, so that's why this is, this is the this is the right this is the right lung, sir. So. Hello there, a good day to you. Welcome to another session on this channel. The scenario which you just now saw is something I have come across many times being an examiner. <laughs> In fact, uh, I have been on both sides of the table, frankly speaking. <laughs> Brings back memories. In the scenario that you saw just now, the student did do the correct side determination of the organ, that is the right lung. However, the points that he gave for the identification of the lung, that is where he went wrong. So what would have been a better way to answer that question? Let us have a look at that scenario once again. The specimen that I have, sir, is the right lung, sir. Is the right lung, yes. Why, sir? Yes, sir. So um, in, in the, the specimen that I have is the right lung. And in this case, we, we can see that, um, the, that it has got a thin anterior border, the border is thin, that should be placed anteriorly. Then there should be a, a broad rounded border that should come posteriorly. Then the apex, that is the conical part, sir, should come, should face above. And the broad area which forms the base of the lung, sir, that, that should come below. And uh, so when you hold it like that, you have the surface that faces laterally, that is the causal surface and then the surface which has got also the hilum sir that, that should come medially so this should come medially, this should come laterally the apex should face above and the broad surface also called the deformity surface should face below the thin border is the anterior border and the uh, broad border sir, should be posterior so if you hold the lung with these features sir that's why I conclude this is the right lung sir, uh, sir and uh, also Usually in on the in the right lung we see uh, three lobes, sir, and there are two fissures. That that can be variable, sir. Uh, so that's why I say this is the right lung, sir. Yes. Sir. So simply put, side determination of the lung should never, never, never be done by the identification of the lobes and the fissures because that will always, that will uh, mostly be. So the proper method of determining the side of the lung would be first we uh, find out the parts of the lung, orient the lung accordingly and then determine whether the lung belongs to the right side or the left side. As always, please do make sure you view, share and like our videos. If you are new to this channel, Please make sure you hit the bell icon for future notifications and do not forget to subscribe to the channel. So till we meet again next time, stay safe, keep smiling, God bless.